Why, hello! I'm the book baker, S.L. Hutcherson, and welcome to today's book review. Today, we're reviewing The Tethered Mage by Melissa Caruso. So this book is really, really interesting because the magic system is based on falconry. It's like training the birds of prey is the way that they train the people who have magic and there's like, there's a mage tethered to a falconer and it's really, really interesting. It makes for this um, very unique world. It's about two women, a mage and an heir, who are tethered together in an effort to protect the empire. To give you a better feel for the book and um, to really grasp the concepts, I shall now read the book jacket. <laughs> Magic is scarce in the Reverian Empire, and those born with such powers are strictly controlled, taken as children and conscripted into the Falcon Army to be used as weapons in the time of war. Zara has lived her life on the streets to avoid this fate, hiding her magic mark and thieving to survive, but, her, but hers is a rare and dangerous magic, one that threatens the Empire. Lady Amelia Cornero was never meant to be a falconer, heiress and scholar. She was born into a treacherous world of political machinations. But fate has bound the heir and the mage, and war looms on the horizon. A single spark could turn the city a pyre. So there we have it, the book. It's quite good. And why, you ask, am I doing the Tethered Mage review now? Well, it's because there is a new and exciting development from the author. There is a brand new spin-off series coming soon. It's coming June 2nd, and it's called The Obsidian Tower. If you haven't started reading any of this author's work, you really should. So overall, I give this book a 10 out of 10. I really loved it. The world building was rich and vivid. The food in the book made you really hungry. It was kind of like in the best sort of way. The magic system was really new and interesting. Like I've never seen that done before, and so it was really cool. And the characters were just so vivid and relatable that they just came alive on the page. Like you just really, really rooted for them as the story progressed. All right, now it's quote time. Okay, here we go. I'm not good at these games, not like you, Mama. Then don't play. Figure out what you're good at and make that the game. Be unafraid, Amelia. If you are without fear, they will assume there is reason and hesitate, and the grace of victory shall favor you. No, I said, I am not only one woman. Reuven checked whatever fatal word he had been about to utter. He tilted his head in mild curiosity. Oh? I smiled back at him. It was a killing smile. I am an empire. Alright, <laughs> so that's it. The Tethered Mage, an excellent, an excellent book. I highly recommend it. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you'd like to see more book videos, especially if you'd like to see fictional food created into real food, because on this channel we do book baking. Bye!